There are lots and lots of these earth balls out today. And like we mentioned, the gastromycetes. Now, it's not always easy to tell which one's the older ones and which one's the younger ones. This is an older one because you can see it's broken apart. It's a bit like sort of an old leather football. And you can see the spore mass in the middle there. Okay. We'll have a look inside these young ones, and this is the one that I looked at. Oh, actually, let's have a go at this one. This one's a bit firmer, and you can see it's formed like a little tuft, so you don't always get just one fruit body. So if we cut this in half, we can see this is very, very young. You can probably see that there is a difference between the outside section here, which is very pure white, and this section here. So this is where the spores are being formed here. But this is very young. So obviously, if you squeeze this, you might get a bit of juice out of it, but you're not going to get any spore production. If we go into this older one. It's got a little bit more give. Now, it will eventually create itself a little hole in the middle, but oh, look, it's gone really quite leathery. I wonder if I create it a hole. Mm, no, I wondered if I could persuade it to chuck spores out all over my office, but it doesn't seem to want to. And to be fair, on reflection, that's probably for the best. So, this, as it grows up, produces all these lovely sort of dirty greyish, greenish, khaki-ish spore masses. And you can imagine how many millions of microscopic spores you've got in here. Now, this is still slightly moist, which is why when I squeeze it, oh! Ah, there's a little dry bit up the top. Can you see those spores puffing out? There we go. Contaminate my office. Well, that's fine. It isn't very good at um, infecting already treated wood. So that's fine. And you can see it is attached to the ground only by this little tiny stem and then this section here has got those little white mycelial um, sections. Oh, we've got a bunch of little invertebrates on here as well. That's one of the other joys of fungi. If you like invertebrates, then you'll enjoy looking for fungi. So you can see that mycelium down there as well. So this is just about ready to start spreading spores. And uh, yeah, maybe I'll take it back outside and let it continue because if it gets kicked around in this stage the spores will dry and start spreading themselves out so that's good stuff what's that little thing oh little mite 